The state picked it for some parts of the state, state DOT uh, and the Thruway Authority, not for the MTA and localities are not included. You know, for New York City D, I can t New York City DOT, I can tell you that would be fundamental. We have looked at the bridge projects that we have coming for the next 10 years, and we think it could save tens of millions of dollars and shave the timetable on some of the major projects, by, just as has happened with the Tappanzi. So um, we are big believers in it and you know, have been talking to business groups and labor and everyone all around the city to make the case. And we are really hopeful that either if the legislature comes back in session after the election or next year that we can get the city included. And is, would it be applied to certain projects or all projects? And if so, which ones? Well, yeah, I mean, that's been one of the debates. Uh, I mean, I think, you know, ideally we would have the blanket authority to do it. At, at DOT, we in particular have been looking at where we think we could get some of the biggest value for doing it. I mean, I'll give you an example. Um, one project that looms large in the imagination I know of the engineering world right now is the, the triple cantilever section of the, the BQE that's under the Brooklyn Promenade. Um, it's a very, very aging set of roadways and it's an extremely complicated I mean, in fact, if you, if you look at it and you sort of think, well, how will you replace this thing? An easy answer does not spring to mind. That would be a project where I think it would be wonderful to do design build and really, frankly, call in the most creative engineering minds all over the country, if not the world, because it's going to be a massive project and very, very complicated.